Hey, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Pamriya back with another Dokkan battle video. So, I know I'm a little bit late to this news, but I wanted to cover it on the channel anyways, just in case anybody missed it. And essentially, with the global maintenance last night, we got some details for a few new cards that are coming to the global side of the game. They've actually been on JP for a little while now, but they are brand new for global, and they're coming with the world tournament later this week. And as someone who is a huge, huge fan of the original Dragon Ball series, I am super, super stoked for them. So uh, let's just jump into it, guys, and start with the World Tournament Reward first. So this Gotenks here is going to be the World Tournament Reward for the upcoming World Tournament on Global, which starts, I believe, on Friday. And uh, he's pretty interesting. He's kind of like the uh, STR base Goku Black that we got a couple World Tournaments ago, or maybe it was the last World Tournament. I forgot, but either way, kind of like the STR Goku Black as far as his uh, passive goes. So uh, let's actually start with his leader skill. It's Super Tech Tight, key plus 2, HP attack and defense plus 70%, and his Super is Dynamite Kick, raises attack and defense, and causes supreme damage to the enemy. And his passive is Warrior's Drive, changes AGL key spheres to tech key spheres at the start of the turn, and youth category allies attack plus 20% and defense plus 10%, and fusion category allies attack plus 20% and defense plus 10%. So the STR Goku Black was actually very similar, except uh, he had boosts for different categories, right? I think it was Time Travelers and Future Saga or something like that, but very similar, like I said. And his links are the Innocent, Saiyan Warrior Race, Saiyan Lineage, Shocking Speed, Over in a Flash, and Fused Fighter. So that is the new World Tournament Reward, guys. And uh, you will get one copy guaranteed if you hit 23 million points for this upcoming tournament. And uh, if you want more copies, obviously you have to place higher, like above 20,000 or something like that. But um, he is a pretty solid support for sure. I don't know if I would go uh, you know, too hard to get extra copies, but uh, he's decent. He's very decent. Okay, so the other three cards, honestly, I'm a lot more excited about personally. And they are the three new Dragon Ball Saga cards that are coming as, uh, I believe, part of the uh, ticket banner, the Dragon Ball Saga ticket banner. And I'm 99% sure that JP has had these guys for a couple months now, and uh, we're just getting them now. So let's start with the SR first, and this guy actually is surprisingly good. So it's the Ruler of Fry Pound Man, Fry, <laughs> Ruler of Fry Pan Mountain, uh, Physical Ox King, and he actually starts as an SR. But even though he's only an SR, uh, he's actually kind of similar to the physical SR trunks that we got for the four year anniversary. And uh, he's a very, very good support for being a card that starts in SR, right? So his leader skill is physical types, key plus two, HP attack and defense plus 30%, super attack is mighty axe, raises defense and causes supreme damage. And his passive is treasure guardian defense plus 150%, which is a very significant buff. Unfortunately, since he is an SR, his defense is gonna be quite low, but um, that's still a pretty big boost, guys. And he does stack defense every time he supers, right? So he could actually be a pretty good, like, I could see him being like a pretty decent tank on events where uh, you have a lot of time to stack defense. And uh, he also gives DB Saga category allies key plus two, attack and defense plus 30%. And uh, that's why I say it said he's really good. Like he's very similar to the SR Trunks because this guy actually gives, he's actually, um, I, I think DB Saga actually has some decent supports, but he is definitely one of the better supports for that category as well. And uh, I mean, that's really awesome. The fact that an SR card is giving key plus two and attack and defense plus 30% to a category is uh, pretty cool to me. So I don't mind it. I know, you know, people don't, some people just won't care because he is an SR card. But uh, to me, I, I think that's pretty dope. Anyways, uh, links are Turtle School, Infighter, Tough as Nails, Incredible Adventure, and Guidance of the Dragon Balls. So there's the Ox King right there. And then next up, we have a new Tech Cyborg Tau, or Mercenary Tau. And uh, his leader skill is Tech Types K plus 2, HP Attack and Defense plus 50%, Super Attack is Super Dodon Ray, cause Supreme Damage with a medium chance of stunning the enemy. And his passive is Thorough Preparation, Attack and Defense plus 100% when performing a super attack, and he also gets attack and defense plus 20% with each attack received up to 80%. So in theory, that's a max of like, I don't know, 180, it might be calculated separately actually. So uh, potentially even higher than 180%, but let's say for uh, ease of calculation right now, 
up to 180% attack and defense, which is pretty crazy. And his links are Crane School, Supreme Warrior, Brutal Beatdown, Coward, Dodon Ray, and Revival. And the last card we're getting with uh, the next World Tournament is going to be this STR Android 8 or Hachan or uh, Aider, whatever you guys want to call him. His leader skill is STR Types Key plus 2, HP, Attack and Defense plus 50%, Super Attack Fists of Rage, causes supreme damage, and lowers Attack and Defense, and his passive is Attack plus 100% for 3 turns after receiving Attack, Attack and Defense plus 80% when there is a Goku's Family Category Ally on the team, which uh, shouldn't be too hard to um, achieve, right? So uh, that's pretty solid too, man. 180% for the uh, Aider as well. And his links are Gentleman, Android Assault, Infighter, Tough as Nails, Incredible Adventure, and Guidance of the Dragon Balls. So there are your three or four new cards, guys. Uh, one new Gotenks here, and then three new DB Saga cards. Uh, that's gonna be part of the DB Saga ticket banner. So guys have been saving up your tickets. Now's a good time to use them, in my opinion, and try to pull some of these guys. And uh, that SR Oxing especially should be pretty easy to obtain since he is an SR after all. And that's pretty much it guys, that's the only news I have for you right now, uh, nothing else too exciting. Aside from the fact that apparently in one of the news releases Bandai said that, or yeah, I think Bandai said that the 300 million download celebration isn't quite over yet, so there could be potentially a part 3 to the celebration, but uh, before more details come out, before we know anything else, I don't want to hype it up too much, so uh, I'm just going to leave it at that once more information comes out about that, because I'm thinking it's just going to be like an extension to one of the, you know, social media campaigns or something like that, where we get a few more stones as opposed to an actual part 3, but I don't know for sure yet, I don't know anything guaranteed, so um, I'm just going to put that out there, take it as you will, and once more information comes out, then uh, I will definitely keep you guys posted in another video, but for now, uh, those are the cards, guys. I am pretty excited for these cards, especially because they are obtainable through like free-to-play means, right? Just gotta be patient uh, with the ticket summons. So that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Anyways, that's gonna do it for this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you guys find it informative. As always, if you liked the video, make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. That's all I gotta say. Hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.